A few months ago, no one expected the year to end this way. We expected a May graduation and full track and field, soccer, golf, and tennis seasons. And the year banquets, concerts, goodbyes. No one expected a Thursday in March to be the last time we would walk out of the doors of SHS as students. It wasn't fair. We had earned those lasts and those goodbyes. We paid our time and this was supposed to be our chance to shine. It isn't fair that we didn't get a graduation like everyone else. But do we really want to be like everyone else? I believe this class will shine. The class of 2020 is a class to remember. The class of 2020 is a class to remember, not because of a global pandemic, but because of so much more. During the four years we attended Scotts Park High School, we had classes in two different buildings. We played in Memorial Stadium. We competed in multiple state championships through math, Educators Rising, DECA, HOSA, Skills USA, Journalism, Drill Team, the list goes on. We started new clubs and events, and we learned about life. We aged a collective 804 years and had 991,000 hours, or 59 and a half million total minutes of school time in the building. That time together has come to an end. Going forward, we all take different paths. Some to the military, to the workforce, to college, to trade school, and a hundred other places. No one walks the same path. And while our shared moments have come to an end, we've all been changed by the experiences of the last four years. No one in this class would be who they are without the adventures we experienced, good and bad including COVID-19. The year didn't end like we wanted it to, but the class of 2020 is strong. We have grown from the last three months and we go out into the world with a higher value of what it means to be human, what a hug from a neighbor or lunch with a friend is worth. And when we come together in 10 years, in 20 years, in 30, 40, and 50 years, we will have more shared memories because of the time we spent apart. The class of 2020 has students born on September 11th, 2001, but we were never defined by that and we will not be defined by this pandemic. We've been a class of many firsts and many successes. We are unique and inspiring and we are world changers. This class is so much more than the one with the pandemic. We will not let this define us. We will be more than a virus. We are the class of 2020.